welcome back to Gapy's Grub. Today we're in the kitchen and we're going to be making a little Christmas treat for the chickens. I made one of these a couple years ago and I showed a video of them eating it, but I haven't showed how I made it. So stay tuned. Spray a bunt pan with some non-stick cooking spray. Add three packets of gelatin, unflavored, to, let's see, I think this is half a cup of cold water. And give it a stir. Now we're going to add our seeds and fruit to a mixing bowl. So I've got six cups of what is scratch and peck, which is a mix of seeds, um, nuts, grains, cracked corn, or you could use bird seed if you want to feed your birds. And I've also got one fourth cup of pumpkin seeds and three fourths cup of sunflower seeds, and a cup of dried raisins. I'm just going to give that a little bit of a mix. We have one and a half cups of boiling water. And we're going to whisk in the gelatin. Add the gelatin and water to the seed mixture, as well as one cup of melted coconut oil. Give that a stir. We're going to take our bunt pan and start assembling our stuff. Now I've got a, a bowl of cranberries here. So I like to put the cranberries here in the, the creases of the bunt pan. It's a little hard to get them to stay put. So what I do is tilt it on its side like this and then just take the cranberries and put them in a row as best you can. I'm going to do four in each crease. And I'm going to take a little bit of the mixture and put it on top to keep it in place. And I'll just move the pan to the next row and put four more. Grab some more mixture, pat it down. Now we're just going to pat down firmly and fill up the rest of the bunt pan. have any extras you can make little balls and that works too. All you got to do is put this in the refrigerator for 24 hours or overnight and it's ready to go. It's time. It should be ready now. Now 
now we're just going to flip this over onto what I'm using is a pizza pan and hopefully it comes out pretty easily. You may need to give it a tap to get it out. Perfect. Now we're just going to get a string and hang it up for the chickens. <laughs>